What's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to Benz with Jim. As you can see, we're continuing the Ted Lasso series. Uh, this is going to be uh, episode two of season one. The name of the episode is Biscuits. Um, if you guys want to watch this full reaction or move, uh, skip along and watch uh, see, whoa, <laughs> watch episode three, already my Patreon down below. So just go ahead and uh, you know I mean, go check that out if you want to. Um, my Patreon will always be an episode ahead. So like, if you guys. See me once episode three is up, four is already. You know what I mean? That's just how it's gonna go. Um, if you want to give a little recap, I guess like episode one was hilarious, but also had some very good serious moments, which is pretty dope, I think. Um, Ted is like who can hate Ted? Like, there's nobody in the world I think can hate Ted. <laughs> he just he just give you that feeling of like making you feel good about yourself in this, in some way, shape or form. Yeah. So, um. Someone told me uh, in the comments that, like, this uh, series only gets funnier, and then it's going to be, like, very heartbreaking at some points, too. So, I can kind of tell, like, the way that uh, episode one ended, that was like, ooh, it came out of nowhere, I did not expect that. Just the way he was going on about the day, it just seemed like he was always happy. Then the ending, yeah. Um, we found out that, uh, well, Rebecca's the villain, I guess, in a sense, but then someone told me in comments, like, be wary who I think is the villain, so... Maybe she's not actually the villain. <laughs> I don't know. We're going to just figure it out as we go along. Um, but like I said, if you guys want to skip ahead to my reactions, uh, down and below is the Patreon. Uh, before we get into this video, hit the like button, subscribe, turn notifications on, check out my merch. Link is down in the description below. Social media channels are also down there. Give me a follow if you guys want. This is Just Cuisines are open. Let's get into this tips episode, y'all. Wait, Orange what? Coach. <laughs> you know what today feels like? First day of school. First day of school, that's right. <laughs> well, heck yeah, no such thing as last day jitters. Oh. Ooh. Sometimes the best way to stick it to the man is go right between his legs, huh? Sometimes stick it to the man, the best way to stick to the man is go right through the leg. Knock a doodle do. Knock a doodle do. Hey, <laughs> or as y'all call them here, biscuits, right? Oh, I'll take a look at there. Oh, it's doing good. Right? Fuck me. Where did you get these? I'm glad you like them. Call biscuits with the boss. That really isn't necessary. Okay, well, mark this down as the first time He's we gonna do it. <laughs> <Garbage water. laughs> uh, first concert, best concert. You go ahead and go first. Go right off the bat. Uh, the Spice Girls, and uh, the Spice Girls. Same answer for both. Wow. Oh, I'll, uh, no, I'm sorry. Hold on. <laughs> Ted, hold on. not something that I have time for this morning, or ever. You're going to show up tomorrow with biscuits, aren't you? Oh, come on now. I would not bet on that. <laughs> I mean, unless you want to win a buttload of money. <laughs> <laughs> High five, tree. Woo. If I were to get fired from a job where I'm putting cleats in the trunk of my car. You got the boot for putting boots in the boot. <laughs> the boot for putting boots in the boot. Seven on seven. We're going to call this drill the exorcist. Because it's all about controlling possession. Yeah, but it lost me too. <laughs> Coach, I'm, I'm sorry. You know what the happiest animal on earth is? Goldfish. Got a 10 second memory. Be a goldfish, Sam. Is that true? Yeah, you got it. Go ahead. <laughs> I don't think he got it. <laughs> Higgins, he wow. wants us to get together every morning to get to know me and hear what I got to say. The nerve. <laughs> and find out when Lasso got those biscuits. What's your plan on doing? Watch out. And if the internet has taught us anything, it's that sometimes it's easier to speak our minds anonymously. She loves crafts. Uh huh. Yeah, I love glimpses into your personal life. <laughs> so, into your personal anything's life. got y'all hot and bothered? Want to know if the snacks in the locker room are tasty enough? Are they? Jesus Christ, they are not. There's a lot of different characters, like oh. different dynamics going on, going on in the locker room. <sighs> It's a long time to wait. Heck yeah! Thank I didn't even hear hills until it was too late. What would you rather be, a lion or a panda? I don't have time for this. Rude. Ted? Gotta go panda. Are you mad? Panda. Lion! What's black and white and red all over? I don't know what. A panda that gets anywhere near a fucking lion. The answer is lion. Wow. Coach, I'm me. I'm not sure you realize how psychologically healthy that actually is. <laughs> I don't think he realized it. Either. Hello, boy. Yeah. What is she scheming up? Wanker. Piss off, wanker. I hope you choke on a Big Mac. Good thing these are anonymous. No boy signed that one. <laughs> <laughs> Shower pressure is rough. Oh, what's a wanker? Wow. I'm a visual learner, so that's very helpful. Thank you. <laughs> My pleasure. Wrong 
Hi, gang. Three's a crowd. Hey, that's a crowd. I don't mind being smack dab in the middle of it, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, boss. What, what was that? Team's got a bond. All right. I mean, heck, Higgins and I are having lunch today. Oh, yes. Having salads in my office. Oh, Higgins, she don't like that. Huh? See you later. Ooh, oh, oh. shit. <laughs> he yes. just had to do that? Nah. Mm -mm. He's intolerable. <laughs> He's intolerable. Hey, Sam's birthday's on Saturday, so I was thinking we'd all chip in and get him something nice. Nice gift or something. Thanks, guy. The, uh, the money in his mouth. He wouldn't. You're me for you. This dude? I'm just taking the piss, mate. Yeah. I'll be better. Promise. How are you feeling about taking on Crystal Palace this weekend? A uh, palace made out of crystal seems mighty fragile, if you ask me. Hey, the U.S. Supreme Court did back in 1964 when they defined pornography. It ain't easy to explain, but you know when you see it. That's a good one. Son. This, uh, this is a care package for my little boy. I'm in here to help cheer you up. Yeah? I'm supposed to set him up in my apartment to help keep you safe. <laughs> Some kind of food or something that just teleports you right back home, make you feel all warm and fuzzy. Oh, the biscuits. She had like he didn't see her look down. <laughs> I'm gonna have a little trouble figuring out Jamie Tart's operating instructions, and I'll, you know, I'll just see if you happen to have any advice. Oh, sorry, I'm afraid. Ooh. How can you hate Ted, man? He's gonna win her over. But I do think it's better looked in the panda. <gasps> Good choice. What would you say motivates him? Blowjobs. Hmm. Is there a second option? <laughs> <laughs> he responds well to positive reinforcement. That's my wheelhouse. There you go then. Okay. Looks like you devoured an antelope. Something. Just be careful. Hold on. No, I feel like it's a lot of it. Yeah, it's a lot. So I'm wait, going to assume she hired that dude. Hey, you got any last words? Speed on the outside. Speed on the outside. <laughs> he keeps talking about speed. That's all we got. Hey, man, you guys got me chin chin. That's no, dope. Wow, wait, this is all I used to eat growing up. <laughs> what's, what's this? Wait, wait. My little boy gave me a whole bunch of these. Keep it safe while I'm away. My dad used to it was just to pinch my earlobes for good luck. <laughs> Give me a fucking break. This dude. I don't really have the same fondness for the American military that you do. Oh, sure. Fine. Right. Mm -hmm. Imperialism. Right. Yeah. Imperialism. Thank you. <laughs> you ready? Your fire's down. How do you know that? Whiskey hire by new She's not into it. <laughs> and there you go. Four and one is crazy. And honestly, say you are the best athlete I've ever coached. A positive reinforcement. I see. <laughs> okay. You are truly great at everything you do out there. Except for one thing. My left foot cross. No. Turn that me into us. God's the limit for you. I don't know how to feel about that. <laughs> He's gonna end up becoming a team player. I got a feeling. Oh, fucking embarrassing! Oh, I, I am equally livid. Oh shit! Oh, nice. oh Yo. my god! <laughs> what the? <laughs> He's okay with it. He'll pick up the mood in here. All right. Uh oh, little five dog and Q-tip coming at you. Uh oh. I know it mean a lot to the guys. Y'all just came down, joined in. Does Higgins hey, ever sit down? You know what? How are you taking the loss? Uh, it's not just me, though, is it? We're a team. I'm just one of 11. Oh. New gaffer's got music on in there. It's like a party. It's a joke. You were rubbish. <laughs> yeah, maybe so. What do you think? Oh, look at that. Gotcha. Yeah. He become friends with everybody quick. Oh, she still kept, she kept it. Exactly what I wanted. Oh, goodness. Star player's girlfriend and the new manager. The press will eat them alive. Oh. Wait, he makes them? Oh, that's about to trigger her. Do it. Oh, Lasso makes Paso and creates Team Fiasco. Whoa, that's pretty good. That bar. <laughs> yeah, I am Q's man and I can run my ass off. <laughs> I like her. destroy me. All right, yeah, so that's, uh, that was episode two. As soon as you think, like, maybe he's, like, getting to Rebecca, she, she, you know what I mean? Something happens, and she just switches. Which I can kind of, now I kind of, I can see it now. I can see, like, she wants to be a good person, but, like, things around her, like, making her 
do evil evil stuff because that's that's gonna suck next episode when that gets out but you know what i mean um yeah that episode tech seems to make friends with everybody he he uh <laughs> talks to like instantly it's crazy I'm not sure how him and uh, him uh, and some of his uh, team players. He got Sam though. Sam became. I feel like Sam's gonna be an important part of this series. Just like the way like they're focused on him a lot this episode. Um, I feel like Jamie's gonna end up becoming a team player eventually. I thought like you know what I mean he Ted got to him right there, but then like you know what I mean he flipped it at the end again. Uh, Roy, I don't I don't know what to say about Roy. <laughs> I I can't like. I, I, can't, I can't figure him out. Yeah, the, the, I don't know. Maybe we'll maybe like we'll see <laughs> later on in the series. But as of right now, I can't figure dude out. Um, uh, Keely, she seems like a sweetheart. Does Higgins ever sit down in her office? Like, every time like Ted goes to her office and Higgins is there, he's standing up on the side of her desk. <laughs> like I don't know. That's like a recurring joke or something. I don't know. I just that's just something I noticed. Um, yeah, man. <laughs> it was a pretty good episode overall, though. Like you find out that Ted is actually making the biscuits. That's crazy. I did not see that one coming. Uh, how did he even know to make? I don't know. Yeah, it wasn't as much like drama as it was. I guess like everyone's calling them. Uh, you know, I mean, I'm not gonna say it because I don't know how YouTube is gonna take it. So you know, I mean, I know, yeah, I know what he's calling what they're calling him. But I don't know, man. I, th I feel like he's gonna like win everyone over before the end of this season. I play that much. Maybe in the next couple episodes. I don't know. We'll see. But I think it's going to win everyone over. But yeah. um, That's going to do it for this video. Hope you guys uh, enjoyed. If you did, hit the like button. Subscribe to the notifications on. Stay tuned for episode 3. Till next time, you guys. Peace.